Melissa, you are the perfect partner for Adam. I remember when Adam brought you over to our house for the first time, you were outside target shooting and I thought, wow, that's a girl for Adam. And if I remember correctly, you were the better shot that day. She's a very strong-willed woman. Very beautiful. Very smart. Good smile. We were in Portugal. I packed his bag, so I was like, there's no way he put a ring in there. It's kind of nerve-wracking to keep it in my wallet or with me the whole time. I remember going through the airport security. I looked over at the screen, you know, and I could just see the big rig sitting in the wall and prayed she wasn't looking at that screen. We went out for a walk in the rain with my parents and grandpa. I kept telling her all night, let's go get a picture in front of that Christmas tree. Usually he doesn't care about them. Oh, what are we going to do with a Christmas tree? Nobody's home to look at it. I think she knew something was a little fishy. And uh, I got down on one knee and... He did it there at the town square of Braga. Adam, I'd like to welcome you to the family. I think my daughter hit gold. We are very confident that these two will really make it through thick and thin, through better and worse. Adam, will you give yourself to Melissa to be your husband? To love her, comfort her, honor and protect her and forsaking all others to be faithful to her so long as you both shall live. I do. Melissa, will you give yourself to Adam to be his wife, to love him, comfort him, honor and protect him, and forsaking all others to be faithful to him so long as you both shall live? I will. with 10 items that they think Uncle Adam needs to have to have a successful, happy marriage with Tia. Number eight, I present you with a Rambo poster. Although Melissa likes to think she looks like Rambo when she's blowing up Tannerite, she's actually just blowing off steam. My advice to you is to allow Melissa the freedom and the ability to carve out time for her family and her friends in your crazy busy life. Know that you're both loved more than we can all express and we can't wait to watch you both grow up into the crusty old fogies you're likely gonna turn into. We're gonna take a trip back to the start. The first time that Ed and Melissa met. I think that was a very pivotal moment in the future of Adam and Melissa's relationship. Melissa got a good look at the old bull and wanted to stick around and see about the young calf.
Alyssa. It's been a pleasure getting to know you over the years. Thanks for taking them off our hands. <laughs> it's been an honor standing by your side today, and I'm proud of you. I wish both of you lifetime happiness. Congratulations, thank you very much. Now I gained another shot. But I hope that they will also bring us some grandchildren. <laughs> hey Adam and Melissa, we wish you all the love and happiness in the world. Melissa, you have won Adam's heart. And I know you will be by his side for many years to come. No relationship is all sunshine, and quite often, it's hard work. But when you find your person, it's worth it. Every single moment.